as you can see, I'm hot and sweaty, and I don't like to be hot or sweaty, and especially both. So, I've been working on my 3D printer, and this happens. I play a video game, this happens. I think real hard, this happens. I'm just a sweaty guy. So what are you gonna do? I got an idea. Build yourself an air-cooled hat. And it works really well. It actually does work well, but it has the disadvantage of being very noisy. And that only cools my head. What about the rest of me? Water-cooled vest. Take a look. Mesh with tubing running through it. Basically what I was trying to get with my shirt this one I got on Amazon for about $250. Comes with a backpack that I'll show you in a second. And we're gonna see if it's gonna keep me cool. Or ladies and gentlemen, the tie will be back on soon. What you're looking at here is, well, it's a body form. Uh, made by putting a t-shirt on and duct taping and taping and taping and taping getting over it and then they cut me out and then we put it back together and stuffed it with polyfill so now it is my shape it is also wearing a blue shirt it's supposed to be water wicking and then we have this box of stuff all of this stuff is what I've cobbled together to try to make my own cooling shirt including a fish tank aquarium chiller so this would actually actively cool the water down on a 12 volt battery ah. number of parts this guy is a 12 volt pump and I had my nifty copper water bottle reservoir and you can see I have various lengths of tubing. I, tubing has been a nightmare to try to find the right size because when somebody says inside diameter, they don't always mean the inside diameter that you think they do or something. So there's my prototype. Here is the backpack. Not too bad, not loving this. Maybe we can do something to make that a little bit better. So when I turn it on, and a little switch back here. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> that really works. Not sure if you can hear it or not. I'll come real close. And it's sort of chugging a little bit there because I just put a solid block of ice and let it melt a little bit. So that's how this works. They give you a pouch that you put inside the backpack that you quick connect up to the shirt oh, it feels so good and then it just circulates that water through until it all becomes your body temperature again which they say is about three hours so in three hours you can just pop some ice in the bag and then that'll last for another two hours battery is supposed to run for eight this is doing a really good job i'm gonna go watch some tv cool off and then we'll be back it's been about 40 minutes since I put the cooling vest on and I found that my double breasted vest that I wear, if I unbutton it and just get the first row of buttons there so it's single breasted, I'm still wearing the backpack and I can sit down and everything. This rocks been wearing the cooling vest and backpack for a few hours now uh, granted I haven't really been doing anything strenuous um, but it's definitely keeping me cool it feels like I have ice packs all around me which is great while I have the cooling vest running I wanted to show you some of the backpack first of all this is the on off switch hear that there we go ah silent I'll go ahead and turn it back on though now, these are the two hoses 
that actually connect the vest uh, into uh, the shirt. It looks like that's about to come off, which would not be good for me. Okay, so zip this guy. As you can see, we've got our water bladder in there. You can feel now it's pretty much at the end of its coolness. Um, it's definitely not room temperature, but it's not cool, cool by any means. <clears throat> so one of these is the return tube, and one of these is the feed tube for that uh, bladder. And this just comes and hooks in here. Little Velcro covers for it. Attaches up here with Velcro and voila. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it off. And I hope that when I unclip here, I'm not going to be draining water every place. Let's see. No, not yay. Nothing out of the shirt, nothing out of the bag, this is good, and while I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and just connect these guys, again, no water drippage, I'll this one if I get my thumb out of the way, <clears throat> so that effectively just connects the shirt to it. I did have a little bit of water in this tube that I forgot about. And that's it. Just pop this puppy, uh, change out the water probably, pop it back into the freezer, let it freeze, and you are good for another few hours. Thanks for joining me, letting me show you my new toy. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And hit that bell if you want to be notified of new content. Thanks, everybody. Have a great night. And if I can do it, you can do it too.